Hi, this is Mr. Biter. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the triple beam balance. The triple beam balance is one of the most common instruments that you'll be using in science class. And you use it to find mass in grams. And today we're going to find the mass of this iron cube. First, let's review the parts. This is the pan. This is where we'll be placing our objects that we want to measure the mass of. Make sure you place it in the center of the pan for the most accurate measurements. Also make sure that it's clean and free of debris or water. Otherwise, you'll be taking the mass of the debris or the water and not just the mass of the object. These are the arms. You'll notice there are three arms. The one with the biggest weight is in the middle, the next smallest in the back, and the smallest are in the front. All these should start off on the zero. This is called having it zeroed. And the line should also be on the zero. They should be matched up. If not, you may need to recalibrate your triple beam balance. When moving these two biggest weights, you can see that there are grooves. You want that weight to rest in that groove. Otherwise, you're not going to get an accurate measurement. Let's measure the mass of this iron cube. We'll begin by making sure it's all zeroed, and we'll place the cube in the middle of the pan. Now we begin with the heaviest arm first, and we're going to move it over into that notch. It didn't go down over into the notch, and it went down. So we're going to go back to that 100. Now the next heaviest, move it across into that notch. Move it across, let it rest in the notch. Move it across, it went down, we're going to move it back. Now we go to the front, and we're going to move that across until we get these two lines to match up. You can use your finger, but you might find it's easier to use a pencil. There we go. Now it looks pretty well matched up. Now let's zoom in and see what number we have. To find the mass, we need to add up each of the arms. This arm's at 100. So we have 120, and this one's after the 7, so that'll be 127 point something. We have to count the number of dashes over it is. So 127 point 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, seven, eight, nine. So 127.9 grams. And that's how to use a triple beam balance. 